My doctor told me in, two, in May of 2001 that he recommended that I leave work because the way my body was reacting to the virus, and even with the meds, the chronic fatigue that I was having and the other issues I was having physically, that I was under way too much stress for me to stay healthy on the long term. And I ignored him. I had never felt more validated in my career in my life. I was doing things that were, I felt were really important. And I loved what I did. I loved it. Building energy efficient schools and establishing criterion for California's energy policy and so many other good things we were doing and it was really wonderful work. So I ended up in a situation where I worked myself into the ground again. Towards the end there, I can remember sitting at my desk and literally being in tears because I could no longer keep up with the demand and I didn't know what to do. And I called my sponsor, and I still have a sponsor in program. She's been my sponsor for 20-some years. Yeah, and I started whining to her about my life was my job, and I made a difference in the world. And she said, honey, I have something to tell you. She's not going to be easy to hear. Said, you used to be important, and now you're not. Get over it. <laughs> I went out and got the tattoos on my hands that day. <laughs> I'd always been tattooed. I've been tattooed, heavily tattooed since I was a young man all over my body. But I didn't have any tattoos that showed when I worked in the corporate world. And that day I went out and got the tattoos on my hands. And I haven't looked back. Mm -hmm.